And what's great about big Greek family dinners is you always have leftovers, like half a container of lasagna. Hi, Women's Health, Sweat Trainer Kayla Dennis here, and today I'm taking you through a little fridge tour. So here's a sneak peek into my very nice, very organized fridge. So if you don't know already, my family is Greek, so I grew up having a Mediterranean diet. And what that means is a lot of fresh fruits, vegetables, olive oil, pasta, rice. So as you can see, this is represented in my fridge. So the first thing I wanna to talk to you about is breakfast. So I know this is not gonna be everyone's cup of tea, but for breakfast, I have two pieces of toast with olive oil. I've got some anchovies in here, which I have on my toast. I also have some Kalamata olives, so that I have in here. Now I have them on my toast, I also have them as snacks as well. And then I just have some cut up tomato with olive oil, salt and pepper on it. And for Anna, I make her a healthy pancake mix here. She has that with some jam and also some berries as well. Okay, so let's talk about snacks. Now I have two of my favorite dips in the fridge. So there is a tzatziki dip, which is a Greek dip. And there is also a hummus, so easy to make. Now, Store-bought dips are totally fine, but I make these in under five minutes and they last for such a long time in the fridge. I have them with these cut up sticks of carrot and cucumber. So this is so easy. Whenever you feel hungry, whenever you need a snack, come to the fridge and grab some of this. So good. Now this brings me to lunchtime. So at lunchtime, I do not have a lot of time. I am on the go, I am busy with Anna, so I need something that is quick and easy. So what I do is I cook some brown rice, I leave it in my fridge. Now for anyone who finds rice really boring, game-changing thing, cook it in vegetable stock or in chicken stock. It is so much better. So I'll have that brown rice, I'll cut up some tomato, some onion, some cucumber, I'll put that into a sort of salad mix, I'll add some tuna, balsamic vinegar, olive oil, it's always the same oregano and some salt and pepper into a big salad and I'll have that for lunch. Now, in saying that, I also have lasagna left over here. So this is a leftover lasagna, leftover lasagna from last night that I can have for lunch. So I can heat that up, I can cut up a salad, I'll have that, some salad, and I'm good to go. All right, so dinner this morning took me 10 minutes to prep. So this here is just some chicken breast. It's cut up with some salt, pepper, oregano, olive oil on it. And then I just put it through, through some skewers with some red bell peppers and some white onion. So that is so easy. You just thread it through the skewer, put it on the grill and it's done. Now, I will also pair that with, there's a few things in here, so I could have that lasagna as well on the side. I could make myself a salad or I could have some brown rice as well. Okay, so I know what you're gonna ask me, Kayla, do you ever have any sweets? So yes, I do. I have popcorn in the cupboard. I have not everyone's favorite, but mint chocolate, which I absolutely love. And I have my favorite, which I got addicted to when I was pregnant. These, I think they're kids' ice creams. I'm not even kidding. Rainbow ice creams, that ice cream on a stick. They are, they are so good. Okay, so that is my guilty pleasures. So if I'm looking for a healthier option other than some ice cream, I get this yogurt, which is a Greek yogurt. Now this is the closest brand that I can find to the yogurt in Greece, which is that really thick, creamy yogurt. And I get this, I want some honey in the microwave. I put a little bit of cinnamon on the honey and then I tip it over the top and it tastes so good. Okay, so one thing that you will not find in my fridge, which is gonna be an unpopular opinion, but is a cold cheese platter. So I have cheese in my fridge. I love cheese as if it's melted on something or if it's in pasta, on a pizza, but I will not have a cold cheese platter in my fridge, sorry. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed my fridge tour. Make sure you subscribe to the Women's Health channel. And if you wanna check out more of my food, you can go over to my Instagram page and check out my food highlight. Everything is there. Thanks, and I'll see you next time.